Greetings YouTube, the other 1-2-3 here, <clears throat> and I'm back for another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy XII, The Zodiac Age. And in today's episode, we're going to be continuing our ascend of the tower. So without further ado, let's get on into it. So if you've been following my guide, you should be at the same point that I'm at. So when you're ready, you want to just go ahead and touch that waystone and follow me. Right then. So we'll try and clear this out section by section so that I make sure to get everything. One moment, guys. Right. So I'll just whack uh, four times on. So, as I said before, keep an eye out for any fake walls because there are numerous fake walls uh, as we go up through the uh, tower. I just thought I should probably point that one out. Uh, so let's have a look here. So like this one here, the Fool's Fakeade is what it will be known as. So if we strike the wall, it will open up a secret opening. Which, in this case, has led us to a demon shield. So that's that fool's fake aid. So in order to progress, we have to take out certain enemies in order to make the bridges appear. And in this case, it's those green coloured candle looking things. I don't actually know what they're called. These ones here. And there'll be a select amount of them for each bridge that we uh, bring into appearance. Here's another one. There's another one just here as well. Uh, let's see what we can find in here, shall we, guys? I'm going to turn the speed down to two times a second because I'm struggling to move around in this maze because my team are moving too quickly. It's becoming a little bit of a nuisance. Oh, another chest. Dragon Helm. Now the Dragon Helm, I believe, is a level... It's either a level 12 or a level 13 helmet. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, it's a level 10. So I wasn't far off. So we should be coming across some... Well, a lot of high level equipment now. We're making some good progress here so far. We're already quite far up. 
We're getting some good training in now as well. Who have we got out on the field right now? What's he got equipped with? Nothing. Uh, where's that gone? Oh, there it is. I'm going to give Van the embroidered tibbet so we can get him leveled up a bit quicker. That way we'll be gaining levels faster and, and I can get some of these other players out on the field and get them leveled up a bit quicker as well. Or at least that's the plan anyway. There's another fool's fake aid. Let's see what we've got. And we get ourselves an X potion. Okay, that's it for this section. So let's continue making our way up. Of course, you'll only have to do this um, once. Once you've activated all the bridges, you'll be able to continually go on up through whenever you want. So that basically just leads us around in a circle then. So as you can see, we're, we're almost on to the next section now. At the moment, we're on the first ascend, the Wall Spring Ravel. And oh, there's another level for Van. This is where things sort of separate out a little bit here. So we'll go section by section here and see what we can find. See, I'm just trying to hug all these walls a little bit because I can't actually remember where all the fake aid walls are and I don't want to miss anything out of this guide so I want to make sure I'm getting them all. So we are going to have to start taking out these red ones now as well as the, uh, as well as the green ones. Uh, we can't get across there yet. We're obviously missing some green ones here somewhere. Let's see if we can't find them. I bet I know where they are. They'll be up here where we haven't been yet. There it is.
There we go. Should be able to get up now. Got an awful lot of loot to sell now as well, actually, thinking about it. Okay, so there's nothing here, perhaps. Perhaps there is a chest that spawns in there, I would have thought. But for some reason at the moment it's choosing not to spawn. Which is fair enough. Let's move on. We should be able to get across this bridge now. Yep, there we go. Let's go this way. Let's see what we can find. Oh, there's another chest with a remedy in it. It's always useful for getting rid of those nasty status alignments. So far, we've not had anything too tough come at us, so we're doing alright for now. Can't get across there at the moment, that's interesting. What's going on there then? Ah. I didn't see these ones. And sometimes you might have to go back on yourself a little bit. In order to activate the bridges, we have to kill a certain amount of these things, so it, it, we may end up sort of running back and forth a little bit. Nope, we still haven't killed enough. We need to find more of them. Looks like we're going to be held here for a little bit. Oops, wrong button. Let's speed this up, shall we? Still can't get across, which means there's still one left standing here somewhere. Oh, it's the same one as last time. Have we done it? Can we get across? There we go. Right. So we are now on the fourth flight of the Ascension. So we're making some pretty good progress so far.
Right. Quite amazed this is, isn't it? Certainly keeping us on our feet. Oh, who's that? It's just levelled up. So it looks like Van's about to enter into the 50s very shortly, so we'll probably pull him out and put somebody else in to replace him soon. I want to keep all their levels balanced, you see. There should be something there. Ouch. Guess we weren't quick enough for taking that one out. Positive note, I do believe we are almost at the end of the first ascension now, which is uh, useful. This one's slightly stronger. Oh, it's this one from the trial. That's why he's so strong. I did wonder. Right then. through here then anything we don't want to miss anything now do we uh, apart from that statue thing it doesn't look like there's anything else in here to be grabbed alrighty then Let's just check out the rest of the uh, floor down here before we go up. It looks like we do have a save point somewhere nearby. You can see the symbol for it. Oh, 
Oh, there it is. Well, I think we're good to continue for a little bit longer. Right, in that case, we'll uh, make our way back up these stairs then, and we will make our way through the door at the top. Here we go then. Okay, so the inscription on the door reads, Ahead the watcher waits, second of three, ye without strength, return whence you came. Well, we're not going to do that now, are we? We're going to go on in. And we're going to face off against our next boss fight now, which will take us to the second ascent. Uh, so... Let's see here, where are we? I believe we need to just simply step forward a little bit. Here it is. Giant ass Leviathan. easy enough. Right then. Rotten treasure chest and another rotten treasure chest. Okay, so this waystone here will take us up to the next area. And that takes us to the second ascend, the reach of diamond law. And I think that's where we're going to end the episode for today, folks. We'll uh, continue this in our next episode. So thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye for now.